What do we know about fintech so far? It's been a while since we talked about the link between finance and technology, but let's just refresh our memories with the explanation of some of the basic terms. We assume that fintech is closely linked with the idea of decentralization, while the key technology it uses are smart contracts, distributed ledger technology, big data, artificial intelligence, machine learning, cloud computing, Internet of Things, cryptography, biometrics, and application program interface. Smart contracts are digital contracts that can self-execute automatically when all conditions are met. In general, smart contracts can be described as a computer protocol intended to digitally facilitate, verify, or enforce the negotiation of performance of a contract. In order to be created and executed, smart contracts require distributed ledger technology, something which we call DLT. DLT is a database shared between multiple parties to perform mutually agreed upon transactions based on some consensus mechanism with the key feature of having identical versions of the data, authorizing it with a central trusted party which makes cyber attacks and data alteration difficult. Big data refers to a large group of data that may be structured or unstructured, whose analysis cannot be performed by using traditional analytical tools, as it includes data collection through networks. Big data analysis can be based on artificial intelligence and machine learning, or some other technique that includes one of these. Artificial intelligence is an area of computer science that emphasizes the creation of intelligent machines that work and react like humans and perform tasks such as problem solving, speech recognition, visual perception, language translation, etc. Artificial intelligence or AI has been boosted by increase in data processing and storage power. Machine learning is a subfield of AI that focuses on giving computers the ability to learn without being specifically programmed for such true hand imputed codes. It is focused on parsing out and learning from large amounts of data in order to make determination or prediction. Cloud computing is the use of remote and shared servers hosted on the internet in order to store, manage, and process data, rather than servers and computers owned and locally maintained by each user of the cloud and has significantly increased the capacity of businesses and organizations to generate, store, manage, and use data with lower costs and higher flexibility. Internet of Things is not a technology per se but a concept that uses several technologies with the purpose of connecting everyday life devices to the internet in order to provide value, including facilitating financial transactions such as purchases and bill payments, or providing security services among many other applications. Biometric technology consists of digital capture and storage of unique characteristics of individuals, such as customers, face, fingerprints, voice, etc. Primarily with the purpose of increasing the security of financial transactions. Cryptography is the science of protecting information by transforming it into a secure format and since it traditionally is being focused on the exchange of cryptographic algorithms, it develops in quantum computing and is driving the transformation of cryptography methods. Application Program Interface, or API, refers on definitions, protocols, and tools that specify how different software should interact that in order to allow the development of computer programs that have access to one's bank account information in order to provide a range of facilities.